everyone, and welcome back to Salt Jaga Studios. My name is Jaden Smith, and I'm be your host for Persona 5. So if you guys are familiar with the series, um, or, well, you should know by now, but if you haven't, uh, the full playlist is linked down below in the description. Make sure you guys go watch from episode 1. Persona 5 is a very powerful story game, and uh, the way we've been playing is we've pretty much just been kind of sitting here and making comments of when I'm necessary, but if you guys should, well, you guys should go watch from episode 1. Uh, it's been a really fun game. I strongly recommend if you ever get the chance to play it, to play it. It's been fun even from the beginning so far. Anyways, yeah, hope you guys have been enjoying as much as I've been enjoying playing it. Thank you guys very much uh, for the support. Hope you guys enjoy some more for some. Are we gonna wake up in the prison? Nope. Oh. Yep. Welcome to the Velvet Room. I thought about resuming our previous conversation tonight. That is why I have summoned you. What are your thoughts? Are you becoming accustomed to this place? Ah, glad to hear it. It seems you have nerves of steel. Your rehabilitation determines if ruin can be stopped. Yet, such a feat cannot be done by you alone. But today, you entered a partnership with someone who awoke to the same power, haven't you? Involving yourself with others is an important foundation for your recovery. You've done well. That said, I am not advising the formation of superficial relationships. It must not be a frivolity, but a ring of those who would, by morals or faith, lend you their strength. In other words, they are bonds with those who have been robbed of their places to belong. The expansion of said ring will, in return, help you mature as well. Personas are the strength of heart. The stronger the bonds that surround you, the more power your personas will gain. There are countless people in the city who have talents that a weakling like you doesn't. Why is she so mean to me? You better rack that noggin of yours and get them on your side. We'll change that into power. Confidants. Right. That's how we got, oh god, what's it called? The chariot one, I think, right? Indeed, you should be prepared to use even myself, or your ambitions will not come to fruition. <laughs> we have a deal then. shall become the wings of rebellion that break it thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the full persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and oh, now we have power. the full persona. Okay, cool. Well, you will understand it all in due time. Continue devoting yourself to your rehabilitation. Now this conversation's over. Get lost, inmate.
I can't do this. Okay, quiet down. Still got it, coach. Thanks. Let's go for one more. Still sticks out. Hasn't changed a bit. Pretty boring, right? Sorry. Hey, are you all right? Someone, take him to the nurse's office. You get that saw. He'll pay soon enough. All right, let's resume the match. Oh, sweet, there's a fast travel scene. Oh, Papa Bless, dude. This sucks. Damn it! Oh, people are stubborn, man.
duck face student? Okay. Just to get the ball this man is making you run up and down the stairs between the rings. They can't do it. Oh. for a sec. It'll be quick. Anyway, what's with you? Like how you were late the other day was a lie and all? There's that weird rumor about you, too. What do you want with him? Right back at you. You're not even in our class. We just happen to get to know each other. What are you planning on doing to Mr. Kamoshida? Huh? I see. I get ya. You're all buddy-buddy with Kamoshida after all. This has nothing to do with you, Sakamoto. If you found out what he's been doing behind your back, you'd dump him right away. Behind my back? Oh god, they're actually dating? That's disgusting. What's that supposed to mean? Anyway, people are already talking about you two. I don't know what you're trying to pull, but no one's gonna help you. I'm warning you, just in case. That's all. Why she gotta be so aggressive all the time? Ah, we just went to the same middle school. Anyways, that's not what we're here to talk about. No luck on my end. What about you? Did anything like someone's name turn up? Huh? Special coaching, huh? True. I always see the guy covered in bruises. Let's go talk to him before he leaves then.
Hey, got a second? Sakamoto? And you too. Come on, we just want to chat. Kamoshida's been coaching you, huh? You sure it's not just physical abuse? Certainly not. What are you talking all polite for? We saw him spike you today, right in the face. That was just because I'm not good at the sport. Still, that doesn't explain all the other bruises you've got. They're from practice. Is he forcing you to keep quiet? That's... What's going on here? Mishima, isn't it time for practice? Uh, I'm not feeling well today. What? Maybe you're better off quitting then. This guy's a dick. You're never going to improve that crappy form unless you show up to practice. Didn't you hear? He ain't feeling well. Well, Mishima, are you coming to practice or not? I'll go. As for you, any more trouble and you'll be gone from the school for sure. Bastard. Same goes for you. Didn't the principal tell you to keep in line? <laughs> Just don't get in the way of my practice. All these unsettling rumors are making the students anxious after all. That's your own goddamn fault. <laughs> this won't get us anywhere. Let's go, Mishima. Shujin Academy is a place where those with aspirations come to learn. Unworthy students like yourselves don't have any right to be here. Get with the program. Yes, sir. That asshole. He's gonna pay for this. That guy is a dick, dude. What a There's shitty no teacher. Point. Huh? Proving that he's physically abusing us is meaningless. Everybody knows. The principal, our parents. They all know, and they all keep quiet about it. This has got to be a joke. Don't be a pain. You don't understand what I'm going through. Shouldn't you, of all people, know that nothing's going to help? <sighs> Damn it. What? I guess because he's the pride of the school? I'll try one more time to persuade the other guys. That's all I can do. All the uh, free DLC items I got. Let's do it. Shot. 
Shaka. I have to give it- that guy does not give up. Shouldn't you be heading to volleyball? Uh-huh. Dog, she has a black eye. That bruise above your eye. Is that from practice, too? Y yeah Are you sure you're not pushing yourself too hard? Getting abused, idiot. I'm okay. Volleyball's the only thing I can do right. Shouldn't you take that? It's probably just my part-time job, I think. I should get going. Shiho. Um, are you sure you're okay? Uh-huh. Yes. T today won't work. I'm... I'm not feeling so good. Sorry. Bye. Hey, wasn't that Takamaki? Rumor has it she's dating Kamoshida. Seriously? I heard people saw them in his car together. You know, she seems pretty easy, huh? You think I'd have a chance to? Uh, come on, dude. You can't go after Kamoshida's oh. bitch. <laughs> Oh, all right. Objectifying. Hell yeah, dude. Woo! Pretty sure she's still underaged. What is it? Then I'll... Actually, the most innocent person in this entire game. Damn it. What the hell? This really ain't going our way. All of them kept saying the same shit Mishima was talking about. Kamoshida had to have told them something. At this rate... Looks like we'll have to go to him directly. 
I know. But seriously, isn't there something we can do? No way I'm gonna give in like this. Can you think of anything? So you want to tell them about the castle? They never believe us. <sighs> Have any other ideas? But Kamoshida doesn't know about the castle either, so... Oh, that'd be fine if we could do it without getting caught, but if we did, we'd be seriously done for. You got any other ideas? What do we do? The king? You mean that other world's Kamoshida? I didn't think of that, but is there any meaning to... I finally found you. Uh. You say something. Don't think you can get away with not paying me back for helping you. <laughs> that voice. Is that you, Morgana? How dare you up and leaving me the other day? The cat's talking? I am not a cat. This is just what happened when I came to this world. It was a lot of trouble finding you two. Wait, you came to our What is world? happening? <gasps> Does that mean you've got a phone? You don't need one when you're at my level. I did get pretty lost making my escape, though. That aside, why can you talk? You're a cat! How should I know? You hearing this too? <laughs> Meow. This is no time to be <laughs> You guys are having a rough time of this, hmm. I heard you mention something about witnesses. Oh, shut up. You know, I could tell you a thing or two about what to do about Kamashita. You were pretty close just a moment ago. God, that condescending attitude. This thing's gotta be Morgana. You were still doubting me? God, quiet down! Uh, we really have to be looking for a cat in a busy time like this? I just heard a meow somewhere near here. Didn't you hear it? Uh, make sure you check every nook and cranny around. Meow? Does that mean only us two can understand what Wait, you're so saying? we were two psychopaths talking to a cat? Looks like it. What the hell's going on? Anyways, what you were talking about earlier... You're quite the skeptic for being an idiot. Hey, tell us more. Then again, this probably ain't the best place. Here, stick it in your bag for now. It should be... Hey! How dare you treat me like... <laughs> Don't be so rough with me! Enough of that! You said you know how we can do something about Kamoshida, right? It has to do with what this guy was talking about earlier. You'll need to attack his castle. What do you mean? That castle is how Kamoshida views this school. He doesn't realize what happens in there, but it's deeply connected to the depths of his heart. Thus, if the castle disappears, it would naturally impact the real Kamoshida. What had happened? A palace is a manifestation of a person's distorted desires. So oh. Precisely. You sure pick up things Her fast. Oh, okay, that makes sense. For real? He he's gonna turn good? But is that really getting back at him? Erasing a palace essentially means forcing the owner to have a change of heart. However, even though their warped wants disappear, the crimes they committed remain. Kamoshida will become unable to bear the weight of those crimes, and he'll confess them himself. You for real? That's possible? Oh. And since the palace will no longer exist, he'll forget what we did there as well. Not only will we be able to bring Kamoshida down, but there won't even be a trace but of I our thought involvement. But Kamoshida doesn't know what happened, because he doesn't know it exists. How do you know we went there? I'm confused. That's amazing! You are one okay. incredible cat! True. Except for the cat part. So, how do we get rid of the palace? By stealing the treasure held within. 
stealing? I'll tell you more once you agree to go ahead with this. It's my most valuable. If you want to help me out, I'll glad. Alex running dry looking for witnesses. Guess we have no choice but to go along. Good. Oh, right. There's one more thing I should tell you. If we erase a palace, there is no doubt that the person's distorted desires will be erased as well. But desires are what we all need in order to survive. The will to sleep, eat, fall in love. Those sorts of things. What are you getting at? If all of those yearnings were to vanish, they'd be no different than someone who is shut down entirely. They may even die if they're not given proper care. So... They might die? Will you listen to everything I have to say first? Would their death be our fault? Aren't you determined enough to face those kinds of risks? Hey, what do you think? I mean... <sighs> For real? There has to be... I mean, I believe the fact that there has to be a reason for him to have gone like completely evil in that regard. I come all this way and this is what I get. It's not like because anyone it does will ever find that out. He's a former Olympian. So clearly something happened to him to where his dreams got crushed. And then him becoming a gym teacher is that how he kind of takes his frustration out of the world. That's not the point. If we just go around secretly doing whatever we want, we'd be no better than that effing Kamoshida. Isn't this your only option? I'll come back later. Make sure you've made your decision by then. Man, we're getting all worked up for nothing. Mm. Damn it. I'll try and see if I can figure out another way. Come on, let's get out of here. Oh. Well, anyway, that's going to end today's episode. Thank you guys very much for tuning in this episode of Persona 5. If you guys enjoyed, make sure you guys do subscribe. Get ready for some more Persona tomorrow. I will see you all there. Bye-bye.